the evening quiet in the west of Ukraine, broken by the sound of Russian missiles hitting their target. Hours after the attack, a fuel storage facility still burning, smoke still covering the skies over Lviv. The capital Ukrainians say may be the heart of the country, but Lviv, with nearly 800 years of history and cultural heritage, is its soul. We personally thought that they will not touch West Ukraine because uh, they were uh, targeted mostly to the East Ukraine, Kiev, uh, Chernihiv, and the big cities in the Dnieper the River. Now they are uh, attacking the cultural heart of Ukraine. I think it's terrible. We didn't come here from Kyiv to hear bombings. It's war, it's real war. It's terrible, really, because people are dying. All our cities, perfect cities, beautiful cities, are, you know, destroyed. And it's time to stop it, because it's 21st century. What can we say about more? There is outrage here. Ukrainians say they feel betrayed by Russia and despise Vladimir Putin. They are the Antichrist. Ukraine has never attacked anyone. Why are they doing this? They don't need the people or land. They don't need anything. All they have is their meaningless ambitions. It's just horror, blood, death and despair. The roar of a wild horde. The tiny grey man has done a lot of black, horrible evil. He's a beast. The west of the country has seen some high-profile attacks since the Russian invasion began, but Lviv was spared the worst of the violence, warning sirens likely to be taken more seriously now. Loud thuds and explosions have shattered the relative calm that Lviv had been experiencing throughout this war so far. We've just heard reports that the target of the attack from which this smoke is emanating was a fuel depot on the other side of the city. Lviv has been at the center of the country's humanitarian response to the war. The wider region has also been key as a military hub. Moments before the first attack, we met with the city's mayor. He says he speaks to his counterparts coping with the destruction of their own cities every day. Uh, today, all cities in Ukraine uh, have a very uh, similar uh, situation. I don't know ways uh, target uh, next uh, Russian missile, but my, uh, my duty is uh, security my citizens and uh, safe uh, for uh, refugees. A job made more difficult with attacks within Lviv city limits. As night came, more missile strikes hitting more targets. This is the closest the war has come to the center of this city, an escalation that brings the war right to the heart of Lviv. Zain Basravi, Al Jazeera, 